Hey, what's going on, y'all? Herbie from lifeisatrucker.com. I want to give you some disadvantages of becoming a trucker. Because, of course, as with anything, there are pros and cons. Some of the disadvantages are, you might not make as much money as you think being a new driver. I'm telling you, more than likely, you will make anywhere between... Depends on how you start. I elaborate on that if you go into CDL training options. Or click on the link in the disadvantages. What I mean is, for instance, if you go to a free truck driver training school, you're coming in at the lowest end of the salary range. And as far as the listings you see in the paper, then you got to be careful whether that number, whether it says the average driver makes as opposed to new drivers here make if it says the average driver makes don't allow yourself to think that that's what you're going to make starting in so commonly a so commonly a new driver oh so commonly a new driver can make 30,000 40,000 a year well the first year and after that you can very easily make more than 40000 If you can't make it at the company that you're at, you can go to another company. A huge impact on the family is another disadvantage. If you already have a strained relationship, trucking can, can destroy it if you're not careful. It's hard to plan ahead for important dates. This is not a line to five. This is a lifestyle. So, you know, the best you can do is let your driver manager, your dispatcher know far in advance and remind them as you come up to that point and the problem with that is if you try to do that often then you're going to miss miles on the road which means again that your pay won't be as much as you thought it was because you can't be running and at home at the same time you will be away from family for extended periods of time you can't explain i mean you can't depend on being able to get home during emergencies it's harder to maintain it's harder to maintain a good diet while on the road it's harder, but it's not impossible. And it doesn't have to be that hard. You just have to think ahead. You have to plan. Get you a cooler. Buy your stuff before you get there on the road. And choose healthier food options to fill that cooler up with. The cost of driving on the road can be expensive. Again, you plan ahead. Buy the cooler. Use the cooler. Don't buy stuff on the road. Wear and tear on the body can be high. You can mitigate that. Stop, get out, get some exercise, even if it's just for a couple of minutes. Walk around the truck. Um, and like I said, eat correctly. But the wear and tear on the body, get your exercise. We do a lot of sitting. Studying, studies have been done that shows that sitting is very destructive to the body. can be very stressful. We talk about ter personal development. If you engage in the personal development activity, there's plenty of stuff on this site. To read about I got books I got courses I got all kind of stuff but you can counter the stress by having by improving your coping skills improving your communication skills improving your relationship skills and you can limit the amount of stress that you experience you will not be supervised so you must be responsible for yourself I think that's self-explanatory you can become depressed if you're lacking in the personal development aspect, it's easy. By default, that's what can happen because other things fall apart. If you don't handle your money right, don't handle your relationships right, then and you end up not liking the job, and you can't get along with the dispatcher, you can see, and you're not making the money that you thought you was going to make, you can see how all these combine together and boom, all of a sudden you're feeling bad, you're feeling... And now you got a cycle going because now if you're in a relationship, this person is experiencing you being depressed, maybe not probably don't even know what it is, but they just know that you're not the same. And now they think something else is, you see what I'm saying? So you have to be careful, guys. That's why I write all this stuff. That's why it's all here for you to be able to stand on the outside and look at the big picture and be more mindful and aware of how you're dealing with things. Because all of this stuff you can avoid since we're talking about it now. You see what I mean? You become antisocial and it's easy to develop bad habits. Again, just think about what the end result is that you want. What are you out here to do? You're here to make money? Well, you don't want to be spending a lot of money on smoking, picking up bad habits, chewing, uh, the, chewing, uh, chewing tobacco. 
You know, even vaping, listen, if you don't do it, don't pick it up because it looks cool. They don't even know what issues that's going to cause, if any, but you still, you got to buy this stuff. It's unnecessary if you don't do it. I mean, people, to each his own, but we're talking about specific things here, and that's why I'm bringing it up, so consider that. Don't do something because you see someone else do it. Think about what goals you have and what you would like to do and how the things that you're considering doing are in line or not with those goals. As far as becoming antisocial, if you don't intentionally mind, uh, nurture your relationships, especially if you got a significant other, then you can become content to just driving up and down the road, not talking on the phone. Depends on your personality, but it happens. It happens. Even I saw how I had become more antisocial as a driver during the period that I was writing my books because I didn't answer the phone, didn't do anything. I was just write, 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 write. I didn't even go out there and interview and talk to drivers as much as I, I was. And so by the time that I came off the road, you know, I, that was at the same time I was still writing. I, the desire for interacting and everything with other people was not that high. I had to make myself get back into that loop. So watch everything, you guys. And I'm going to end it right here. Come to the page. There's a lot more details. Um, I'll go further into each one of these things. Thanks for watching. Peace.